Hello, TTL coaches, and welcome to Huddle One. Let's start by looking at the SEL focus for Huddle One. We're talking about relationship skills. Our objectives are that captains will discuss the importance and purpose of huddles. They'll list their responsibilities as a captain on their soccer teams, and they'll practice relationship building in game setting. Here's an overview of our SEL lesson. First, you're going to define what a huddle is and discuss the purpose of a huddle and what we want to do as captains for our soccer teams. Then, you're going to work together to create a community agreement. This is an agreement that discusses the behavior and expectations during huddles. You'll start with the question, in huddles, I want to feel. Then you'll discuss what action should we take in order to support these feelings. Then, how do we want to agree to support each other during huddles? And finally, what will we do if we take actions that interfere with these positive feelings of the huddle? You'll decide on what your choices are for your community agreement, and then you'll continue to remind each other about this agreement every huddle and make any changes that are necessary. Now, let's take a look at the games we'll play in order to support this relationship skill building. First, we'll start with a name game called Group Juggle. Then, we'll work on Peanut Butter and Jelly Tag. And finally, you'll look at Rock, Paper, Scissors Cheerleader, and if there's time, Rock, Paper, Scissors Tag. Then, you'll finish with a group scrimmage. Next, let's preview our Captain's Corner. The purpose of the Captain's Corner. This is where we will discuss current goals, practice advanced skills, and discuss any situations the team is having that you can help with as a leader. During the month of October, the soccer program will be in the weeks three through six. So let's review some advanced skills from those times. Today's move is sweet spot taps. Small touches back and forth between your feet using the inside part of your foot, the sweet spot. Keep your knees bent and softly touch the ball. Ready for a challenge? Our advanced skill is to do the sweet spot taps, but looking up. Look up while you try this move and try to keep the ball where you want it. This week we're focused on dribbling. Try dancing on the ball. Alternate your feet, lightly tapping the top of the ball. The ball should be placed in front of the player, not directly under them. As fast as you touch the ball is as fast as you should remove your foot. Remember, don't push down on the ball, just tap. Ready for a challenge? Try our advanced move, dancing on the ball while dribbling. Try to dribble while dancing on the ball from one point to another. Now let's take a look at what practicing advanced skills in a TTL huddle might look like. In order to create a safe and supported environment, this week's priority is to focus on your procedures. Start by introducing an attention getter, then practice transitions from the snack room to the field and from the field to dismissal. Then think about your break protocol. How will you take breaks for the bathroom and to get water? And finally, think about how you want students to circle up for your reflection. And check out our TTL curriculum website at www.uicoach.org forward slash TTL. Here you'll find the digital curriculum and helpful links. And please give us your feedback on the curriculum by filling out this curriculum feedback form so we can always improve.